Hello, it's Alex here, back again for another vlog. Hope you're all well. Now, if you're a regular here on this channel, do you remember the very first video that I uploaded? Nope, well, it was worth a try. Let me remind you, it was this one, which was my YouTube 30 day challenge video, where I basically set myself uh, the challenge to upload two videos a day to a brand new YouTube channel and yeah, basically just see if I could get some views and maybe make some money and, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, it wasn't this channel, by the way, it was a, a channel all around apps, iPad apps for kids. In fact, the channel's called Apps for Kids. After that video, I did a few other update videos like this one and this one, basically just sharing what was going on and um, explaining that I hadn't quite stuck to the challenge as, as well as I should have done. I didn't upload every single day, but I did in the end upload around 30 odd videos. Now that was three years ago. I know, doesn't time fly. And, you know, since I did that, I didn't really keep an eye on the channel. I didn't do any uh, any more work on the channel, didn't upload any more videos, didn't even check the analytics, just kind of forgot about it. Um, until the other day, where basically YouTube have made some changes, it's some new law that's come in, and you now have to set on the channel whether the videos are aimed at kids. So I kind of thought, well, I better update the settings on that channel because those videos obviously are kind of aimed at kids and iPad loving kids, basically. <laughs> So yeah, I went in to upload the settings and well, I was greeted with this fantastic analytics report. Have a look. Yeah, wow, look at that. So for a channel that I've not done any work on for, for years, basically, um, it's still growing and it still seems to be doing really well. So, you know, in terms of views, it's doing like 97,000 views in a month, um, nearly 4,000K, or 4,000K, that doesn't make any sense, nearly 4K watch time. Um, subscribers are still growing. The total number of subscribers is like 1,600, something like that, which is more than this channel that you're watching right now. So, you know, that's pretty impressive. And in terms of revenue, it's around $100 a month. So that really kind of blew me away. And yeah, I mean, I'm trying to think of what the message is and what we've learned from this for this video, because I, I like to have, you know, some sort of message, some sort of useful piece of information within my vlogs. If you hadn't worked that out already, that, yeah, that's the idea of these. I'm trying to share something with you. Um, so, yeah, what have we learned? I guess what we've learned is that you can create a YouTube channel from pretty much nothing. Um, you know, you don't have to record your face or anything like that. You can just literally record some apps on your iPhone or your iPad, stick them up without any commentary or anything like that, because I didn't do any of that on those videos. I literally just recorded me playing the uh, the apps, didn't say anything or anything like that. So yeah, you can create a YouTube channel from basically nothing um, without having to do too much work on the video side of things, just, you know, record a screen. So I guess that's one takeaway. The second takeaway is um, patience always be patient with these things you know it doesn't happen overnight you do have to wait and you know I waited three years on this channel I guess but I'm sure some stuff happened way before then but yeah patience is a virtue when it comes to YouTube once your videos are up it does take some time to get some traction um, but when they do get traction well you can see what happens your channel can really take off and I think the third takeaway from this is that it only takes a couple of videos to really push your channel forward. So in the case of, uh, of that channel, Apps for Kids, if we actually drill down and look um, at what videos are actually doing the business in terms of getting the views and, and driving revenue and all the rest of it, it's only a handful. And in fact, one video, um, which one was it? I think it's the, uh, the Saga Mini Forest Flyer thing. Over the last month or so, that video has just exploded and it's you know getting about 90% of all the views on the channel. So, I thought that was quite interesting because that means that you, you really do just have to keep putting videos out, whatever your channel's about, you've got to keep putting those videos out because uh, eventually you'll create a video that really strikes a chord with, with people or that really fills a gap um, in terms of what's out on YouTube or you know for some other reason just really get some traction and just explodes and that's going to bring you in a ton of subscribers, a ton of views and it's going to you know push all the other videos on your channel up. There we go. <laughs> I think we came to some sort of reasonable message and uh, we learned something quite useful from this experiment. And yeah, I'm really pleased that I've got a YouTube channel that's doing you know, 100 bucks a month without any work to it. I was actually considering maybe making some more videos for it. <laughs> maybe I should. There's obviously uh, something to it and it's, you know, maybe it could be something really big. But um, we'll see, you know what my time management's like, whether I can actually get around to doing that. 
But yeah, anyway, that brings us to the end of this vlog. I think I may have had to do a few little edits. I don't normally edit the vlogs. Uh, you probably noticed that, but this one, there was a few pauses and there's things going on outside here. I've got decorators in and all kinds of stuff. So I might have to do a little edit, but I'm, I'm sure you won't mind it. You know, it'll be fine. And yeah, let me know what you thought of today's vlog. Leave me a comment or question below. I do read all the comments that I get. And maybe I've inspired you to kind of come up with some random YouTube channel idea and, and just do it. If you have got a random YouTube channel idea, do it, really, seriously, just do it. Just create some videos, stick them up, and um, let's see what happens. You never know, it's quite exciting. And personally, I found YouTube to be a fantastic platform, and um, it's one of the easiest ways, I think, to actually get a bit of um, exposure, get a bit of traffic, and, and you know, possibly even earn a little bit of money. Anyway, I'm gonna go, I'm rambling. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I'll put some stuff up on the screen now. Click on my face to subscribe, check out the other channel, all that kind of stuff. And there's a couple of other videos chosen especially for you. I hope you enjoy them. Until next time, bye for now.